Welcome back to another DaVinci Resolve tutorial. Today we're exploring the interface to help you feel right at home. Let's dive in. When you open DaVinci Resolve, you'll start in the project manager. Think of this as your workspace hub. Click new project, give it a name and you're ready to begin. At the bottom of the screen, you'll see several icons. These are the different pages, each designed for a specific part of your editing journey. Let's quickly go through them. First is the media page where everything starts. This is where you import your videos, music and other assets. It's like a digital library where you organize your files before jumping into editing. Next is the cut page which is great for quick no fuss edits. It's streamlined and fast. Ideal if you're working on short videos or need to make basic cuts. Then there's the edit page, the heart of DaVinci Resolve. This is where you'll spend most of your time. It's packed with tools for trimming, arranging clips, adding transitions and more. Perfect for creating polished, professional edits. Now, the fusion page. This one is for the creatives. It's where you can add advanced visual effects and motion graphics. Think text animations, particles or even 3D effects. The color page is a game changer. Whether you want to tweak the brightness, fix colors, or give your footage a cinematic look, this is where it all happens. You've got tools like color wheels, curves, and even lutites to make your videos stand out. The Fairlight page is all about sound. From adjusting volume levels to cleaning up background noise or adding effects, this page helps you get your audio just right. Finally, there's the Deliver page. This is where you export your video. Whether it's for YouTube, Instagram or a client project, you'll set your file format, resolution and other export settings here. Now let's talk about the key areas of the interface on the edit page. As I told earlier that edit page is the heart of DaVinci Resolve where we will spend most of our time for video editing. On the top left, there's the media pool, your library for all imported assets. In the center is the viewer where you can preview everything as you edit. Below that is the timeline, your workspace for arranging and trimming clips. On the right, you'll find the inspector panel. Select a clip and this panel lets you tweak settings like size, position and rotation. Above the timeline, you'll see tools like the blade and selection tools, which make editing quick and easy. And that's your DaVinci Resolve interface. Each page is designed to handle a specific part of the editing process, making it a powerful all-in-one tool. If you found this helpful, give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more quick tutorials.